This is the second time Katakawa has been credited in the beginning of the episode. Shit, a full house and I can't even remember what play I'm doing. Oh, it's an orchestral performance. Carry on. That is the shiniest flute I've ever seen. Having a history in theater production, both on stage and off stage, I can safely say that everyone in the audience can hear this entire conversation. That guy looks and sounds like a dark-haired Yu Narukami, and this guy looks like Negi went through puberty and doesn't care. Oops, I must have bumped the brightness on my monitor. Wait, that's just the magic of a well-shined instrument. Is this the end of the show? Because it feels like the end of the show. Aw, oh, they made the title look like music notes. Well, this got immediately dark. I'd mark this one down on the heart meter, but it's actually contrasting the extremely bright instruments in the previous scene pretty well. Hear about those bloody music notes? Fucked up, am I right? And now it's all bright and cheery again. Where in the story is this show starting? Bless you. Don't you hate it when you sneeze and the Hot Pants Brigade ambushes you? How much do you think they rehearsed this beforehand? If there's one thing anime is good at, it's making me believe Japanese school club members are fucking crazy and constantly desperate. Dodge roll. Maybe she won't join because you're making the volleyball club sound like a cult. Well damn, it's no wonder why they want her for the team if she's been able to carry that full of a backpack since junior high. Her shirt says banana and has a picture of a banana. I can't get over how much I love her eyes, especially the spiked lashes. Here's a point for style. So wait, she doesn't want to become a musician? She just wants to seem... girly? Sure, she sneezes earlier and you're all on her like she's a... well, a volleyball. But now she sneezes and it's icky. Wow, the male and female student clothes are way more different in this school than any others I've seen. He's a teacher? Did she just twinkle cough? How do you make an already cute anime character cuter? Chibi! This girl has used the word maidenly twice now to describe someone being cute. I have my doubts that this is the first time she's seen a pretty boy. Incorrect! Chika-chan is obviously yellow and has a cupcake. <laughs> this guy doesn't think that in the nine years that they haven't seen each other, she might have changed her personality slightly and rudely brings up how she used to be. Look, I know this guy probably is not intending to come off as a jerk, and we're clearly attempting to go for the she has to realize that she didn't have to change because she was perfect just being her theme. But seriously, it's obvious that she doesn't want this stuff brought up. Take the hint, Blondie. The lines under his eyes show that just being around these two for a few short minutes will cause you to age dramatically. Different colored hair ties, hair swept to the opposite sides, each coinciding with a clipped strand, and both playing different instruments. Yep, I'm still gonna get these twins mixed up. This guy sounds older than the teacher. This club has about the same number of initial members as Genshiken. Their names are Kai and Sai. You're trying to trick me now, aren't you? Did nobody see this note already? This is giving me vibes of that Spongebob episode where Squidward and his rival have a battle of the bands. If this episode ends with them all playing Sweet Victory, then I'm done. This anime wins. Cool, now play Song of Storms. Everything this guy says sounds pretentious and condescending. I would like to take this opportunity to point out that earlier the teacher had said that Homeroom was starting, and they went into a three minute long, showtime, rant about how Bach slipped his own name into musical notation. I'm not sure why they're worried about the teacher erasing the notes off the board. You have blank sheets, right? Copy that shit down. This guy is such an asshole. Rude. Anime food. This girl is eating all by herself, obviously stuck in a parallel anime of her own. Aww, she's so happy and this teacher is so nice that I'm gonna bump the heart meter up twice just to shove it in the blonde jerk's face. This is the most serene Rocky montage I've ever seen. Wow, she had an even better idea than my blank music sheet one. Now I feel old. So, to be clear, it took this girl calling this jerk a smartass in order for him to solve the puzzle. Typing white clover meaning into Google will give you an early search response that only declares this flower to mean think of me in the aforementioned language of flowers. Where these two girls get revenge from is beyond me as the flower of revenge is said to be the bird's foot trefoil, Lotus crinculatus, which is a vibrant yellow plant in the pea family Fabaceae. This guy already looks way older than when we first saw him. Love will do that to you kids. For paint that's been on the blackboard all day and possibly a whole night, it's coming off really easily. They must all be pretty talented. I've been playing bass for years now, and I still struggle at the beginning to catch on to the tune. This guy might be crushing on his mysterious teacher. Her shirt has a face. This girl is adorable. Also, this girl might be crushing on her mysterious teacher. Every cat ever. I'm not positive, but I think I've just confirmed that they are both, in fact, crushing on their mysterious teacher. 